Hi guys, John here with a uh, new installment of my video blog. It's been a while since I've done one of these. Sorry about that, but I just had to do this. Look, I was just taking a break and watching ESPN on TV, right? And they just made the announcement that Tiger Woods is going to be coming out and giving a public statement. And he's going to be apologizing and all this kind of stuff. And this knucklehead on ESPN goes on to say, you know, basically this was the whole point of his whole conversation, this guy on ESPN was like, well, you know, the American people are very forgiving. We like, you know, guys who fall down and get back up. If their apologies are sincere and heartfelt, and if we think they truly deserve a second chance, I have got to ask this question. Who the hell does Tiger Woods owe an apology to? He certainly doesn't owe an apology to me. He sure as hell doesn't owe an apology to the knucklehead on ESPN. He doesn't owe an apology to any of these sports media guys, and I'm a huge fan of sports media. He doesn't owe an apology to any of them. He doesn't owe an apology to the American public. He doesn't owe an apology to golf fans anywhere. Look, the guy went out and have 12, 15, 20, 30, whatever mistresses. That ain't good to do. But it means he has to rectify the situation and apologize and seek forgiveness from his family. Nobody else. Let's say I'm a golf fan and I find out that Tiger Woods has been lacing his golf clubs with, I don't know, kryptonite that somehow makes his golf balls go further and makes his putting more accurate. And I'm a fan of golf and I'm a fan of his because of that. You know what? If he was caught doing that, maybe then he owes me as a golf fan an apology. I can understand that. Let's say, I don't know, he assassinates a public official. That's a crime against all of us. Then maybe he owes an apology to me and to all of us. What that dude did has nothing to do with me. That what that dude did has nothing to do with the knucklehead on ESPN, has nothing to do with anybody else anywhere. It has to do with him and his family, and that's where he's got to work it out. If he's got to take time off golf, good for him, cool for him. I hope he gets his, you know, his stuff straightened out. Whatever. But he doesn't owe me an apology. He doesn't owe you an apology. He doesn't owe the stupid idiot on ESPN an apology. And the way the sports media has been handling this about, oh, Tiger, you know, at some point he's going to have to face the questions. He's going to have to come out and why? Why does he have to do that? He didn't do anything to anybody other than the real people he's got to rectify this with and apologize for this to, which is his family, and that's it. And I wish everybody would just let this go. Anyway, that's my rant on this.